name is Aaron Chandler and you're watching Ko's Chai YouTube channel. The perfect place for theme park news, reviews and vlogs. After all, I've always got roller coasters running through my mind. <laughs> Hello there guys, my name is Coach Shadongster Born, Bob Built for Theme Park News, and welcome to a Theme Park Newsroom update from GeForce at Drayton Manor Theme Park in Tamworth, Staffordshire. Now before we get started, make sure you like the video if you've loved it, comment down below your thoughts and theories, and subscribe to the channel, and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. Share the channel around with your friends, family, and on social media, and for now guys, let's get into this video. So, this is on the current situation of GeForce, the Marathon X Car Roller Coaster. Uh, we now know that they are finally dismantling the ride after a year SBNO in 2019. They're finally dismantling it piece by piece. Now I'm going to speak about two speculated parks um, in this video that are rumoured or speculated to be uh, interested in getting this ride into their park. Um, and it's two very different parks actually as well. Um, now one is in Pembrokeshire, Wales, the other one is in Lowestoft, you can probably guess, theme park enthusiast by now. Um, now these parks are Pleasurewood Hills and Oakwood. Now both parks have an interesting history, both parks have a great coaster lineup for the, for the UK theme park industry. Pleasurewood Hills has the likes of Wipeout, which is a Vacoma Boomerang that used to be Missile at American Adventure. Uh, and also the SBNO Cannonball Express. Now we spoke about in that video, in, in a separate video, about the future of GeForce and where it would go. Uh, we spoke in that video about how the Tide Traveller site is a good site for um, the relocation of GeForce from Drayton Manor. If Pleasurewood Hills was to be the part to get it. Uh, now, of course, you've got the Cannonball Express site, but apparently that's been rethemed or rebrought back to life, ready for the 2020 season. Haven't seen much work from that yet. We've only seen new work on the entrance on the Pleasurewood Hills, so uh, it looks like new entrance work is taking place. If Pleasurewood Hills or Oakwood were to buy this, I would suggest that they keep it until 2021 and put it up over the next winter season. Uh, or they could put it up over 2020, surprisingly, and open it in May or June or in the summer sometime, you never know. Uh, now the other park I spoke about is Oak, it's speculated to get it, is Oakwood. This is just speculation, it's not confirmed they're getting it at uh, Pleasurewood Hills. And the other park is Oakwood in Pembrokeshire, Wales. Now this park uh, is home to some great coasts including Megaphobia and of course the Gersai Eurofighter Speed the Ride. Now, or Speed No Limits, however you like to sort of say that there. Um, now Oakwood is another good part to get this right because they've got a very versatile coaster lineup and I feel like a multi, a, a couple of inversion uh, prototype coaster would be a great addition to the park. Now the question is would it fit with the park, with, with both parks target markets and I think it would be the most thrilling end to the target markets because they're both family fun parks, they're both family thrill parks. So I feel like it'll be more the thrill end of the scale. So with, with Pleasurewood Hills, it'll join the likes of Wipeout uh, and Cannonball Express on the thrill side of the park. Uh, same with Oakwood on the likes of Megaphobia and Speed. They're the more thrill sides of the park. So this will be part of the thrill section of the park. Um, now, I think both parks could feasibly be get it. Uh, but I feel I feel like with Tide Traveler being removed from Pleasurewood Hills, I feel like Pleasurewood Hills will get it more out of those two. Just speculation about those two interested in buying it, but I feel like Pleasurewood Hills is the most likely out of the two to get it. Now, thank you very much for watching this small theme park news update. Like I said, GeForce being dismantled by the same people that installed it all them years ago when it first opened. Um, and like I said, the two parks speculated to get it are Pleasurewood Hills and Oakwood. So, uh, very interesting news there. Thank you very much. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. My name is Coach Child, Killing the Coach's Life, and I will see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, have an awesome day, friends. 